Hello everybody and welcome to this video where I'm going to tell you the mistakes every new poet makes when writing poems. That's fun. I'm gonna point out your flaws. <laughs> this is so fucking stupid. So there's a couple things here that every new poet does. And it's funny because if the new poet doesn't break this habit of doing these things, they will continue to do this their entire career until somebody points it out to them. And then they'll probably feel kind of stupid and pretend that they haven't been doing this their entire career. Oh my God. And then you get those people who have decided after writing 500 poems, now that they've had this pointed out to them, they're like, oh, I should rewrite those 500 poems that I've already written. No, don't fucking do that. Just fucking put your pen down. Jesus Christ. I'll tell you why right now. What happens when you change history? You don't learn from it. Just saying. You gotta have your flaws hanging out there, swinging like dingles in the wind, okay? So you remember not to do that. Okay, so the first thing that a new poet typically does is that they write too little. And what happens when you write too little? Now, when I say write too little, I mean you you just wrote like three lines with two words in each line, okay? Might sound cool, and if you're lucky, sometimes it even has a fucking meaning that people could go, oh, huh. But at this point, all you've done is written a phrase with line breaks, with, an, with M jams. When you write too little, there's nothing that differentiates your work from anyone else's who also does the same thing, okay? There's not enough room here for most people to be able to have voice when they create. And I have a video about voice. I might put it up there, um if I remember to do that, that you could watch if you haven't watched yet. The other problem with doing this is that your poem becomes so fucking vague that anyone reading it, like, no one has any fucking idea what you're talking about. Like, if it's just like, blah, 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 blah. It's like those words might sound great together, but what the fuck are you saying? So that is one thing that new poets do. Another thing new poets do is they write way too fucking much. They just write and write and write and write and write. And I'm not talking about number of poems. I'm talking about the number of words in a fucking poem. Suddenly their poem is like eight pages long and it's just completely spilling your guts on the page, which is what I love more than anything. Believe me, I love when people spill, okay? But the difference between spilling your guts and poetry or spilling your guts and art is figuring out a way to take what you just wrote down and simplifying it. So you have to be able to simplify what you did. Now, if you're one of those people who does not want to do that, like, oh, no, this is my art, and, like, I like it like this. Cool. Like it like this. And just keep it like that. But something's going to happen to you, okay? In about, like, two years, two, three years, you're going to notice that you are starting to take words out of your poems, you're going to try to clean up your poems. I don't know why this happens. It happened to me for fuck's sake. Okay. Something just clicks where suddenly you're like, oh, wow. Like I'm way too verbose with everything I'm fucking saying here. I need to pull out some of these words. I need to tighten this up. I need to clean this up. I need to like just say less but in saying less, I need to actually say more. Are you, are you understanding what I'm saying? So even if you don't want to listen to me now about this, fine. I don't give a shit. Do whatever the fuck you want. But just know that in like two years, you're going to notice that your poems are already starting to not be as huge. 
And when that happens, you could then come back to this channel, come back to me, apologize, and just keep watching my videos then, okay? Because again, I was right and you were wrong. <laughs> I think we're gonna leave it there. Two things that every new poet does, all right? Um, I have more things here, but I think we're gonna sparse these out a little bit at a time, okay? So if you found this interesting, crack them thumbs and um, type hard, everybody. And I will talk to you all later. I just want to give a quick thanks to those people who make these videos possible. Anarchy Crew and my followers on Patreon. I appreciate the hell out of you guys. Thank you so much for keeping me going to keep this content possible. You guys are awesome. And if you'd like to join the crew of the Anarchy Crew, just hit the join button beneath this video. And if you'd like to become a member of my Patreon, you can run over to the link down below to do that as well. Thank you.